Hello and welcome or welcome back to Megan TT Hobbies and surprise surprise I'm actually back today um, July 15th 2020 with two TTM returns so I'm going to quickly go through these this could be the second video that I update today because I did last night's recap but I posted it this morning so let's keep this roll going as surprisingly on a Wednesday. I got a couple TTMs. So this next one is coming in from uh, Indianapolis, Indiana. Sent on the 6th. So right at 10 days. And signing looks like three of three. Rick Mount. Shout out to Michael Myers for this idea. Not only did he play for the Pacers, but he also played at Purdue. So I had this card that he signed nicely. And then I had created a couple of customs for him. And he signed those quite nicely. And always when I send the customs, I always send the player a copy. So that is a nice, quick three of three coming in from Rick Mount. This next one is interesting and hopefully very successful so looks like he sent, signed 506 and I'll go into this a little bit uh, Chandler Harnish who was a uh, quarterback drafted out of uh, I think University of Washington no sorry uh, Northern Illinois the Colts drafted back in 2012 and he was just basically uh, drafted as a backup he's no longer in sports but I had quite a few cards that I had for him, but there is a story with this. And then this is the only one not signed. He either skipped it or uh, just didn't want to sign it. Um, so I was just kind of looking at the letter that I'll read here in a minute so I was able to get like a bazillion of these Colts team sets minus the T.Y. Hilton rookie and minus the Andrew Luck rookie so I was like you know what let let's try an experiment and I sent like 200 something of these cards to the players and said you know keep them for fans that write you and I thought that would be cool because like this is his rookie so this is the first one that came back um it's probably been out for about three weeks and then he signed these five for me I sent out I think five or six all were fairly challenging uh private addresses that I had to figure out I have about four more left with some pretty big names in there like Reggie Wayne who's going to the Hall of Fame. Um, so we'll see what happens. But again, I had like 200 something of these and I said, hey, these are a gift to you to give to other fans, friends, family members to do whatever you want with them. And could you just sent, sign a few of these? I also sent along a blue Sharpie, which was brand new in package. But if you if you didn't know, you can pretty much pick them up uh, at Dollar Tree. And it's a nice little single packed Sharpie to send out. And then they were all sent in like a bubble mailer. And then I only sent like my small white, uh, plain white envelope to send them back. So, um, so I asked him like what his favorite memories are with uh, Northern Illinois and the Colts. And um, he put all sorts of 
cool uh, information on here. Um, it said, and he said, thanks for the support at NYU. It was winning the, let me put some of these cords out here. It was winning the Mac championship was the best because we hadn't done it in 28 years. Uh, for the Colts, it was his first preseason game. He did, he says, I threw a long TD pass in front of all my fam and friends. Uh, wisdom for her boy, for our boys. Always put the team first. If the team succeeds, all the individual awards will come along. Remember that there is always someone out there working harder than you, so never get content and always stay hungry. Put God first in all you do. So, really cool return for Chandler Harnish. So, if you happen to write to him and yeah, get one of these cards, you'll know where they came from. Like, comment, subscribe. Let me know if you have any questions about this little project I'm doing. I'll feel free to answer them. And I think that is it. But man, a couple videos, a couple days in a row. Keep these TTMs rolling. Again, like, comment, subscribe, and thanks for watching.